when I see these people, they worry about Quran's Arabic. You fools, we have unbroken sequence of Quran coming for 1400 years in the hearts of people. Hearts here, inside our hearts. What can you do? And you worry about us. You people know that how many Bibles were there and you just canonized them. You know that, that there is a difference between, you know, books between Roman Catholics and Protestants. Six, seven more differences between or each of them. 166 books, 172 or 73 books. How dare you people talk to us that what's your original Arabic? We have Arabic. We are not the slave of translation. We have the original, the Arabic which was left over by Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him. Unbroken coming. There's no other book on the surface of the earth. You know that? Which is recited by hearts. And you people, you don't even have the common source. 5,000 manuscripts you are boasting about a New Testament in London Museum. No two are identical. 20 or 10,000, more than 5,000 or whatever, 20,000 manuscripts you are boasting about Old Testament in the museum. No two are identical. Then how would you know that which was from God, which was not? Through churches. Churches decided that this is from God, this is not from God. Jesus never endorsed them. Did Jesus endorse all these kind of documents? No. That is why you have Matthew, you know, a book of Matthew according to Matthew. According to Mark. Why according? Because you know that these books are not endorsed by these particular names. Assumptions. Conveniently, you take their names to show the citings. You know, in citing in English subjects, we do citing for students. They have to cite where they took this, uh, you know, article. Otherwise, they will they will be charged for plagiarism, and they do it. Can you believe it? The Bible has been plagiarized. They have been endorsed without any names, and you brought up the religion and you talk on us. Judge ye not that you not be judged under what judgment you are judging others, ye hypocrites. Why see the smug in your brother's eye? First remove the beam from your own eyes, then see the sliver in your brother's eye. Hebrews chapter 7 verse number 1. A good hammer, a sledgehammer from Jesus Christ to you people. Worrying about other people, worrying about things, swelling the whole camel, but worry about the gnat. What do you have? What do you have? You're Arabic, you're Arabic. You, you have your Bible in Greek. Jesus never spoke Greek. Jesus belonged to Eastern. You people got Western culture into the Bible and you laugh on Arabic of Quran. You're trying to tell us that in Arabic of the Quran, this should not be there. This should be there. We are learning from you. We have unbroken secret. The highest tafasir explanation of the Quran is no other book on earth has it other than Quran. You know that? Tafsir explanation of the book from unbroken secrets of science of Hadith the one whom the book has been revealed to, Messenger Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu he dictated those translations from Sahaba. Not translation, tafsir, explanation, what he meant when the verse was revealed. You know that? We have every data. And Jesus said so. He will guide you into the old truth. I will end this. What do you have in the case? 